What's happening, my Lake Titicaca frogs? How you doing today? Yes, there literally is some weird looking frogs in Lake Titicaca, and they have some weird names too. But, before we get too far into this game, we gotta talk about what we're gonna do today, and that is... Monkey Knowledge Pack Unboxing! I've got 36 regular packs and 8 ancient packs. It's probably the most ancient packs that I've ever had compared to these regular packs. And it's going to be really, really fun to open these guys up. So, let's open them up, guys. we got 44 packs to go. Maybe we'll even have more than that, because sometimes you can get free packs. So it's taking me a long time to get all of these packs. But bam, 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 bam. Get yeah, two rare cards here. So, by the way, if you haven't noticed, I'm only at, like, rank 5 and 6 so far on most of my guys. I think I have ninjas up to, like, like rank 9 or something like that. So that's pretty solid overall. But as long as I get, like I said, as long as I don't get three commons and a rare, and a rare, I'm, I'm good. You know, as long as there's at least more than one purple card or more than one red card so far, it's been going pretty reasonably well. Um, I have very few common cards so far, but again, it doesn't really matter all that much what I'm getting. Um, everything's gonna go, Oh, look at this, that might rank up my, my dart monkey. Oh, so close, man, so close. So the Dartling Gun's getting pretty close as well. A lot of these guys, man, almost rank 6. This could be a good chance for us to get a lot of ranks up on a lot of different towers. Sadly, though, the rank 5 is, like, the big one, you know? So here we go, we got a, a wild card. Man, oh, I'm rank 10 on the Ninja. What is that? 6 Shurikens and 7... Yeah, all right, all right. It's pretty solid, man. I gotta go with the Ninja. He's just the best tower in the freaking game. He just is. So I'm really hoping to get one of those super-duper mega super rare cards. Um... So that was okay. Ooh, look at that, man. <laughs> Monkey was here. I like that. Even banana farms are actually not that bad to get some uh, really cool upgrades for. But yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Banana farm. Eh, I guess we're reasonably close to banana farm. We might get it today if we get any sort of random uh, a legendary cards. But we still have gotten zero legendary so far, man. Come on, bro. Come on. Somebody sent me a picture the other day where they got three legendaries in one pack. Um... A long time ago, though, somebody sent me a picture where they got four legendaries in one pack. The luckiest man in the entire world. The chances of that are like one in like 625,000 or something like that. Something ridiculous. Um, but he made it happen. But when you have millions of players playing, it's bound to happen at least once, right? So here we go. This is the one that I don't generally like. Three commons and a rare. It's like, meh. You, you can't... I don't think you can get four commons, though. Um, almost positive of that. Somebody said that they had it happen, and I, I don't think they ever sent me a picture, and I don't, I don't believe it. Don't believe it at all. So we got like, uncommon, uncommon, common, and rare. Buy packs now. Maybe I should buy some packs. What do you guys think? Mmm, give me some delicious packs. So again, nothing too special over here. Just kind of the normal. I'm waiting for my big break. The big legendaries, or the big dark blue card. Ooh, another purple rare. Mmm, ninja rank 10. So how much experience does it take me to go up these guys? Does it tell me? I think it actually tells you. But okay. That's alright. It's alright. I get it. Blomp, blomp, blomp. So we get another Dart Monkey. I think we're going up a rank. Dart Monkey. Bam! No. 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 Triple commons. It's a little bit on the upsetting side, I suppose. I have a feeling if they do come out with a BTD6, they're going to do something very similar to these monkey knowledge packs for BTD6. Um, where, like, you can... Oh, this is the first bounty card we got all day, man. Normally, those are pretty, like, reasonably common. So this was a nice pack right here. A bounty, two uncommons, and a rare. That's what I'm looking for most of my decks, man. Just pop pop those guys in my, in my mouth right there. Pop them in. Eat them right up. Eat them right up. Nom those guys. I've been salivating a lot lately. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I'm hungry. But, like, generally, like, even, like, last night, like, when I was going to bed, I was salivating a lot. I'm like, why? Why am I doing this? I guess we got 15 more packs to go. Get a double rare right there. That's pretty solid. Ooh, and we get a nice little guy right here. So, what was I might have to upgrade the Dart Monkey and the Boomerang with my next, uh, wild card. <gasps> There's a Dart Monkey! Rank 7! Oh, no, rank 6! Base cost and all upgrades cost 6% cheaper. It's pretty nice. I gotta say that's a pretty nice, uh, it's a pretty nice uh, little thing right there. All upgrade six percent cheaper. 
Though it does make it a little bit more confusing on when you're buying them, you know, it's like how much do they actually cost now after the price decreases and increases and everything. So we another Dark Monkey over here. Super Monkeys are getting kind of high up there. Monkey Ace again, kind of high up there as well, but just not quite there yet. Come on, man, we're due for a Legendary. Just give me one Legendary, that's all I want. One Legendary out of these normal packs. Out of 36 packs. Gotta be due for one. So we get uh, two rares again. Eh, too bad. Dark Monkey's not gonna go up for another rank for a long time, by the way. A long time. By the way, how, if you guys are those crazy people who have level 15 all around, you guys are crazy. Seriously, I don't know how you guys do it. It's craptastic cards all around. The cannon might be almost rank 6 as well. Maybe one more cannon that's gonna make it there. Dartling Gun. Oh! Rank 6! Spread decreased by 10%. That's a that's a weird one. It's a weird one. Normally the spread is not usually a big deal for me, so it doesn't really help me out all that much. It doesn't make me like want to use the early gun. Like if it gave me what extra one pierce, I'd be down for that. I'd be totally down for that. So so far, I'm gonna say quite possibly the unluckiest balloons monkey unboxing in the entire history of the world. <gasps> Boomerang gonna go up another rank. Whoop! There it is. Six percent cheaper as well. Very similar to the dart monkey upgrades. Come on, just get, give me a legendary. Give, 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 give me a legendary. Common, common wild card. What do we want a wild card this time? We can upgrade the. Uh, let's save it. Maybe I'll do the cannon at the end if it doesn't give it to me. Nothing else is that close to going up. Monkey Tycoon is also another weird one where you might want to get that guy. Boom, 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 boom. Still nothing that great. Um, cannon's gonna go up though. I think. No, we still dodged it by like 10 experience. Dodged it, man. Playing dodgeball and he just barely. <gasps> Look at the room! We get the buccaneer, baby! Yeah! Did not get a double legendary, though, but I got a legendary double rare. That's pretty solid, man. That's a nice pack right there. Legendary! Woo! Yeah! So we get a couple commons over here and everything, but at least we got one legendary. That makes me feel. Yeah, yeah, it makes me feel good. So the last few packs, too. Triple commons. Suck my balls. Come on, don't give me that crap. So there we go, cannon though. Bigger bombs upgrade costs 150 less than normal. Ooh. I don't use that all that much, but hey, yeah, yeah, not too bad. All right, great poopage right here on the last pack. The great poopage of 2017, man. All right, but now we got eight legendaries. This is big money here, guys. Big money we're talking. Come on, give me something good. Crap. Mega crap. Can okay, we get a bounty? Get a five times supply crit. Alright, and we get our legendary. There's the activated ability legendary right there. Alright, I'll take it. Not the best legendary pack in the entire world, but not awful. We get um an uncommon. Ooh, and we get another bounty card. Someone's tw Yes! That's actually what I need. Twenty thousand city cash. Yes, baby, yes. Get a Legendary Apprentice. Check this out, man. Watch this go up. Look at that. Big money right there. And we get the Monkey Ace. Okay, so that guy's almost round, almost level 6 as well. I think I might end up giving him some of those wild cards. So, bam, we get uh, Engineer. Legendary! Yes, we get the Balloon Sabotage. That just looks funky, man. Balloon Sabotage. What does it say up there? Monkey's Rule. <laughs> I love it. And we don't get one legendary, of course. No double legendaries yet. What's up with that? Come on, give me a double legendary. Maybe even a triple. Quadra. There we go. That's the good way to start off our pack right here. Ice Monkey. Get a rare. Get another rare. And another legendary! Woo! Yeah, baby! So that might go up a rank. Maybe. It's going to be really close, but I don't think it will. Ah, not even that close. Ice Monkey legendary. Not bad. That was a nice pack right there. Double legendary. Double rare. It's not the best you can get, but it's pretty good. So we get another legendary right here, Glue Gunner, with three uncommons. <sighs> Glue Gunner, though, <gasps> rank seven, or rank six. I was, oh, I was getting confused by that. Base cost and all upgrades six percent cheaper. It's kind of the usual. I'm kind of used to that by now. We got three more packs to go, guys. Come on, give me something good. Nice legendary, nice way to start off the game here. Boomerang, ten percent increased attack speed. Wouldn't mind that, but it's going to take a while to get that. Okay, bam, bam, bam. We get our second legendary as well. Another balloon sabotage, by the way. 
Low class ones have 17% less health. Big help right there. Alright, so we got two packs to go. Let's do this, man. Whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, it's an okay pack, but we get a banana farm legendary. Almost rank 6 on that bad boy. Guess I'll take it. Maybe, just maybe, we can make it to rank 6. We got one banana farm here, and I give him my wild pack. So I'm pretty sure I have a wild something. Okay, so we didn't get a quadra legendary to end off the thing. Didn't get a didn't get a triple legendary. Could get a double legendary to end it off. Come on, double legendary. No, no. All right, all right. So we get some pretty decent stuff all over the board. Nothing too crazy happened overall from our packs, but you know it's okay. So anyways, we do have a couple wild cards here. Um, I don't think I can go up any ranks though on any of my guys. The monkey is probably the closest. Oh, actually. Banana Farm is pretty close as well. But not quite there. You can go up to rank 6. All upgrade costs 4% cheaper instead of 2% cheaper. So that's not a bad uh, that's not a bad way to get some extra cash, man. But anyways, that's going to be all I'm going to have for today. If you guys enjoyed this Monkey Knowledge Pack unboxing video, make sure you press the like button for me. Um, I could try to maybe do more Monkey Knowledge Packs uh, in the future if you guys are really going to enjoy these things. But overall, people se tend to like like them, but they don't love them. You know, it's just like yeah, whatever you get, whatever you get, whatever you get happens. But I think it would be kind of fun to um, very specifically try to beat the Bloom Beacon every six hours. I could get at least I don't know four Monkey Knowledge Packs a day couple weeks man be right back up to 50 monkey monkey knowledge packs anyways if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you press the like button for me i would appreciate that a bunch thanks for watching and have a super duper delicious day